They come from a land of ice and snow. Now belugas have a home in Arctico. Reach out, touch, give them a smile. You'll make a new friend for a long while. You never know when you'll fall in love again. So come on, raise your hand. The Chautauqua County Fair is here. Don't miss the seven days of sizzling summer fun this week at the fairgrounds in Dunkirk. Head to J&J's Monster Midway and ride the mechanical rides all day. You'll love the motorsports madness at the Budweiser Grandstand with new shows and more fun than ever before. See all of this year's exciting new entertainment and your fair favorites at the Arthur R. Maidem Family Theater. Get to the fair and register to win a laptop computer. It's the Chautauqua County Fair. Get there. Prepare yourself for a blockbuster-sized Totally Spies adventure. This could be like the most important loot mission ever. You know, besides the one where our mom was under attack. Clover, Sam, and Alex are graduating to super spy status. You've all been promoted. Promoted? What's the catch? And fighting their worst enemy. Behold, our very own army of evil Jerry's. Oh, is that redundant? <laughs> Presenting Totally Spies Undercover, an exclusive movie. Premiering Sunday at 8 on Cartoon Network. <laughs> Rats. Hey, you want to get into the Halloween spirit? Let's go rent a monster movie tonight. Uh, no way, you'll freak out. I won't freak out. Yes, you will. You see a monster flick, your imagination runs wild and you freak out. Besides, monster movies remind me of work. What? and high test scores won't help me if my face is sucked off! <laughs> nice try, dark face. You weren't scared? No. Not even for a second? No. A nanosecond? Nuh uh. But you sure gave Jody a conniption. What's a conniption? There you go. Cool. Conniptions rock. In a world full of monsters and demons, Shun is the only one who sees them. When evil beasts start the plot and scheming, she kicks butt, sounds and from screaming, sounds and from screaming. Go, 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 go. You can't stop the girl. Go, 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 go. You can't stop the girl. When crazy creatures come, she has to stop. It wasn't a problem. She's the one who has to resolve it. Has to resolve it. Happy Halloween, baby. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> June, that's so cute! I love it! I absolutely love it! Who are you supposed to be? Oh, Elvis, Jody. I'm Elvis Presley, the king of rock and roll. Oh. I'm a princess. Of course you are. <laughs> what are you dressed as? Duh! I'm a werewolf robot Abraham Lincoln on roller skates. Oh! Four score and seven years ago. Woo -hoo! Couldn't decide on what to wear, huh? Nope. So I decided to satisfy all my passions. But it's better than Ophelia. She's not even wearing a costume. Sure I am. I'm dressed as 
cooler than you. Oh, yeah. Now I see it. Dude, what's with the skirt? For the last time, boy, it's not a skirt, it's a kilt. Nor is it a costume. I happen to be chilly. Now let's be done with this senseless ritual so I can go home already. Ah, oh, dude, we haven't even hit our stride. Come on, come on, we gotta move. The good stuff goes fast. Now the word is they're doling out whole candy bars on Griffin F. If we don't move it, we'll be getting those sugar-free hard candies in the bottom of some old lady's purse. Oh, you must chill. Chill? Nothing! We'll be lucky to hit half the houses on our block before you gotta go kick some monster's butt because your stupid bracelet starts beeping. Oh, it doesn't beep, Ray Ray. It mostly glows, kind of like Say. a... Say! What do real monsters do on Halloween? I mean, do they tear it up like it's New Year's Eve or something? No. They're out here with us. Where? Well, there's one. And there. And over there. Uh, behind those kids? No, they are those kids. You know how we dress up as monsters? Well, they dress up as humans. Uh, they do this magic spell that turns them into people, and instead of trick-or-treating, they go around and do human stuff. And that's cool. How? Beats me. They think it's really funny. Excuse me, kind sir. What time do you have? It's 6.30. <laughs> Here is some human money in exchange for printed news. <laughs> Can I have the telephone number for Big Bill's Deep Dish Chicago Style Pizza? <laughs> hey. oh, that is so embarrassing. Oh, yeah. Milk chocolate pile one, dark chocolate pile two, nut, nougat, and crispy milk chocolate pile three, other chocolate pile four. You butterscotch. Candy corn, pile five, peanut clusters, pile six, gum, pile seven, oh, bubble gum, pile seven, subsection eight. A toothbrush? A toothbrush? Curse you, Dr. Horatio Rosenberg, did he has a funny to maple drive? Ray Ray, pick your favorite five pieces. I'll be there in a sec to put the rest away for later. Come on, come on, man! Save the nougat, save the nougat! Nice try. What? Hey, Jude, how are you? That's good. I'm just gonna walk around here for a while. That's cool. Hey, I wonder what's on TV. Oh, not much. I wonder how many chairs I can lift up at once. I can't feel my teeth! How much sugar did you have? I don't know. Not much. Who's counting? Get off my back! <gasps> Someone's throwing candy corn at your window. Open it, open it, open it, open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth! What? We got a problem. Uh, yeah, we do. It's like midnight and you're taking target practice in my window with holiday candy. Do you have any licorice? No, this is huge, June. All of the monstrous children have been turned into humans. Uh, yeah, I know. Like every year, so what? Yeah, but we can't turn them back. celebration of Halloween on Fridays. Each Friday this month, we'll show special ghoulish presentations. Tonight, it's the special premiere of Scary Godmother. Say hello to your scary godmother. Plus your favorite nightmares and a few extra guests. Mm. Oh. Mm. Celebrating Halloween with Scary Godmother. Tonight, starting at 8, only on Cartoon Network. I'll take the Trix yogurt and hide in the principal's office. I can finally have delicious two-color Trix yogurt, strawberry, banana, raspberry, rainbow. Whoa! The rabbit's taking our Trix yogurt. He's in the principal's office. Come on! 
Excuse us. Time to clean the office. Can you move you over here? Lift your feet. Hold this. Okay, thank you. Where's my trick yogurt? Silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. This Halloween's even more fun. With spooky glow-in-the-dark tattoos. Six to collect in specially marked packs of Trix yogurt. Today was a great day. We adopted a puppy, and I scored a goal in soccer. Only the password journal lets you decorate your cover any way you like. And it only opens to my voice. Girls rule. That's so cool. Design your own cover with the password journal. The new jam and shred pen is an FM radio. And a secret note shredder. Cool. And the new scrapbook lets you decorate, then record and play back messages. Kayaking at camp was fun. Password journal, jam and shred pen, and scrapbook each sold separately. Batteries not included from Girl Pet. It's him. They always catch me, because I'm as green as me clover hot marshmallow. Hmm. What if I add a new great green clover? Now I'll be able to blend right in. Oh, Lucky. Big news. Lucky's added great green clover marshmallows to Lucky Charms. We're getting closer. It's part of this good breakfast. A little luck. And a pluck. Got him. And his new clover. Lucky pick. Introducing Chuck E. Cheese's fundraising nights, where 10% of your group's sales are donated to your elementary school. Just ask your parents to call this number or log on to ChuckySchool.com for complete details. Chuck E. Cheese's fundraising nights. If you gain all the power you can, if the journey goes perfectly, you still get a big pink fist in your face. Dragon Ball Z Boo's Fury for Game Boy Advance. Rated everyone. When evil comes knocking, microids knock back. Microids are heroes. Microids growl loud. Microids' eyes glare. Microids, you control them. Anywhere. The microids are led by Litteron, Lion-Hearted Leader, Microid Blyray, Tiger Tough, and Microid Norton with awesome Rhino Might. Only you control the microids and the destiny of Earth itself. Microids, each sold separately, only from Tomy. some explainage. All our little monsters are supposed to turn back at midnight, right? But this year, it didn't happen. Look at my son. He's hideous. All pink and hairless and, oh, human. We have a family reunion coming up next week. I will not, I repeat, not take my daughter looking like this. Ugh, with the dimples and the sassy hair. Ugh. Hey, 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 my friends over here. Listen, I can totally get my sister to fix your problem, right? But what are you guys going to do for me, huh? Perhaps if you were willing to part with a little something, milk chocolate, or let's say, nougat? Well, I guess there are a couple of spells I could try, but... This isn't some potion gone wrong. It's something worse. Way worse! Evan, go on, tell her. Tell her what you did this time. Don't touch me. I didn't do nothing. Oh, that's enough mouth from you, young monster. You're in plenty of trouble as it is. He paid an aged demon to hex him into a human forever. Must have affected all our children. <gasps> oh, you betcha. I found this under his bed. So what? You didn't have to ground me. Not another word out of you, mister. To think I sat on an egg and hatched you for nine months. To have you turn your back on our culture, our family. Are you kidding me? Why do you think I hate being a monster? We're so totally disgusting. There's like slime, grody body scales, and I have hair in places you wouldn't believe. And we eat stuff that'll make a billy goat puke. It is so wrong. Oh, now what's wrong with being who you are? Well, I mean, look at me now. I'm like amazingly gorgeous and slime free. I could totally be a model. Okay, okay, I've heard enough. I'll go talk to the agent demon in the morning and see what I can do. Thanks, June. You're a lifesaver. Oh, you just knew it was gonna be Catherine Thompson's kid who'd pull a stunt like this. Calm down, sweetheart. Don't tell me to calm down, Gus. I, I've got a son that looks like Justin Timberlake.
Juniper Lee, Vicky will see you now. Listen, darling, you pull this kind of stuff one more time and I'll personally come down there, tear your innards inside out and wear your ribcage like a hat. You understand me? Good! Now, love you too, Daddy. Tell Mama hi. You must be Juniper. What brings you here? Uh, we got a little problem with the monster kids in Orchid Bay. Seems you, um, cut a deal with the... Oh, right, the Thompson boy. Nice kid. Didn't want to be a monster. I love to help people. I'm a real people person. It's really all about the love. Abby, where's my protein shake? If it's not in here by the time I finish this sentence, you're fired! You're fired, fired! Bring me my shake! And no banana! Yeah, it's just that... Well, you turned all monster children in Orchid Bay into humans, not just Evan Thompson. Listen, sweetheart, I broke her packages. If I change one monster, I gotta change them all. It's an all-or-nothing deal. The kid initialed the contract. Oh, come on. He didn't know what he was doing. And uh, now the natural balance of the world is all screwy, and I have to fix it, so if you could just see it in your heart to... Listen, sweetheart, you seem like a nice kid, and I'd really, really like to help, but my hands are tied. And by that, I mean I don't want to. I work deals here, okay? If you had something I wanted, then maybe we'd be having a conversation. Well, what do you need? For starters, a protein shake that doesn't taste like an elephant's butt! There was a glorious protein shake that I used to get when I was just a little assistant agent demon in the underworld land of Quagara. Oh, to taste that again. All right, I'll get it for you. If I do, will you turn the monster kids back? You got yourself a deal, sweetheart. But the offer expires at midnight. After that, the spell will be too powerful to overturn, and those kids will be human forever. Capiche? Remember her? Used to come in every day and get a protein shake. I know just the way she likes it. Oh, wonderful. I'll take one. Money units do me no good here. For this smoothie, I demand a trade of premium value. Perhaps you could acquire the magical amulet of Turi's Bach, owned by the fierce and powerful Lord Balthazar of Gremble Beach? Young Juniper, I have awaited your arrival. I will trade you the magical amulet of Turisbach for the great goblet of goblins found in the Grand Gorge of Gorgia. <sighs> street as you have the great goblet of goblins. Maybe, maybe not. Bust it to you. Well, I've also been told that you'll trade it for the crystal scepter of Malaperta. You can get me the crystal scepter of Malaperta? No way. It's like a collectible. I shall trade the scepter for one item. The ancient talisman of Remelon. The Onkaflacteria. The Shroud of Baldwards. Nothing. What do you mean, nothing? There's nothing you'll trade? No, 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 no. I'm here to trade. Come on, I'm your girl. What do you want? I can get it. Name it, name it. Come on, come on. Nope, I'm good. Come on! Don't be like that! You want the Orb of Triacle? Uh, how about the Gemstone of the Elfin King Titus? A DVD player? Freaking Flyer Miles? Yellow! Know, what? What do you mean he can't fight? The match is in two hours! I'll fight! I'm a fighter! That's what I do, I fight! Who do you need me to fight? What are you talking about, kid? I need a winner! If I win the fight, you give me the Shroud. If I don't, you don't. Set.
73 pounds, soaking wet, Juniper the Velvet Hammer Lee! Weighing in at 3,716 pounds, two ounces, Jordan the Destroyer! Tell me again how we ended up here. It's complicated. <laughs> starting Monday at 7. We're proud of the programs we offer, but some may not be suitable for young children. Pay attention to the TV parental guidelines ratings and control what your children see. Learn about the V-chip and parental controls available from your cable operator. Visit controlyourtv.org. Hi, we're at the store. We're going shopping. Back with Daddy. Little Mommy Shopping Cart has three ways to play. Want a pair? Okay. You love carrots. Let's put you in your high chair. Time for a snack. Here, sweetie. Want a banana? All done. You're such a big girl. Mwah. A shopping cart, high chair, and hand carry <laughs> basket. Little mommy shopping cart. Adults assemble. Dolls sold separately. Cookies. We better hide this from Daddy. Hey, kid. I'll give you 50 bucks for that wagon. Okay. 45. Take it or leave it. Yes. Wonder what it's like to buy whatever you want? If you find this special money ring in marked boxes of fruit by the foot, you win 10,000 bucks or right to enter. Many will enter, two kids will win 10,000, hundreds more can win other cash prizes. What? Fruit by the foot. The cash goes on and on. The rabbit's got our trick. He's joining that race. I'll blend in and finally have Twix cereal. Raspberry red, orangey orange, and lemony yellow. Whoa! I know how we can get our tricks back. Come on! Congratulations! You get this and this. I'll take that and you get this. Where are the tricks? That's our silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. Trick cereal, a fruity part of a complete breakfast. I haven't run out of ideas yet. Introducing Zavix Virtual Tennis. You may forget it's not real. Zavix. Welcome to a new reality. Rated E for everyone. Game and port sold separately. all people within our nation. To denounce the evils of truth and love. To extend their reach to the stars above. Surrender now or prepare to fight. There's a new way to battle Pokemon and it's wireless. Pokemon Fire Red and Pokemon Leaf Green are here and now you can collect, train, and battle in a whole new way only for Game Boy Advance. Rated E for everyone. Microids growl loud. Microids eyes glare. Microids, you control them. Anywhere. Only you control the microids and the destiny of Earth itself. Microids, each sold separately only from Tommy. <laughs> <laughs>
on the run now, darling. You got him scared. You're wearing him down. He's almost getting tired. Or at least a wee bit bored. Oh, are you sure there's no way to defeat this dude? Ah, plenty of ways, if you're fighting in the field. But this is a pro match. Uh, what? Oh, come on, I'm getting my butt handed to me on a platter out there. I thought you were just giving the crowd a good show. His name is Jordan the Destroyer. He's destroying me. And need I remind you, we only have like an hour and 20 minutes to get that smoothie to Vicky or this whole stupid quest was for nothing. All right, all right. No need to get snippy. If you want to weaken him, you could pull out the second horn on his tailbone and he would shrink to a quarter of his size. Then you'd be a shoe in If you don't mind cheating at professional wrestling. <sighs> Fair. Tough. this chatterhead. I said, hey, if you don't tell your client to... There! What is this? What do you mean, what's this? I went to the land of Guagara, traversed the Gremlathad beach, climbed Grand Gorge of Gorgia, trudged through the snow of Malapare to brave the rapids of Remularty, survived the forest of fire and ice, swam the vast fields of nothingness, and fought Jordan the Destroyer for this! It's your protein shake! Oh, yeah. I thought I asked for no banana. Undo the monster spell. Okay, okay, a deal's a deal. I'll make the call. Shouldn't take more than a second. Hi, sweetheart. Hey, Gary, how are ya? Great. Marsha and the kids? Oh, you are kidding. Oh, she did not. That's amazing for her age. My little one didn't take her. The spell the spell! Right. Listen, sweetheart, you know the deal I made with the Thompson boy? Right, yeah. I need to reverse it. Okay, thanks, I'm sure. Dinner next week sounds fab. Oh, and if you're one minute late, I'll tear your eyes out. Bye bye <sighs> Did I mention how much I hate Halloween? Sure, she'll fight again for the right price. I'm thinking a hundred thousand bucks plus a bucket of dark chocolate with almonds. Uh, thanks for inviting us to dinner, Mrs. Thompson. Oh, you betcha. Yeah, it was the least we could do to thank you for fixing the horrible evil that Evan wrought. I am so sick of you bagging on me. <gasps> Uh, so, what do you call this, uh, delicacy? Ooh, that slime! Whatever it is, it's amazing! So, uh, 
What's for dessert? More slime? This is the ABC's of me, baby! <laughs> Scary Godmother! <laughs> Gentle viewers, let's hear it for the Scary Godmother! <laughs> you still owe me for eating all of the food at my Halloween party last year! You promised to do anything to make up for it! Oh, I don't remember such a promise! Oh, please, I'll do anything! I know you will, Harry. You'll help me in the pumpkin patch, you'll knit spider webs, clean the tombs. Oh, yes. You'll probably have tonight paid off by Halloween next year. Enjoy your pizza. <laughs> oh, right. Now, get busy. We have to prepare for both Halloween and our big party. B -b -b that's what I'm doing. What do you mean? Are you saying that telling a scary story, a monstrous tale, a veritable ghost story, isn't preparing for Halloween? Hmm. Well, I... what I mean is... Fine! But when you're done, I need you to separate the dragon's eggs from my special flambe souffle. Ooh, uh, separate the whites from the yolks? No! Separate the eggs from the dragons. <laughs> Now, let us cast our gaze towards an average house in an average neighborhood and meet a boy named Jimmy. We open our tale with poor, poor Jimmy. He used to love Halloween and dressing up like a monster. But that was before last Halloween, when he found out a terrifying secret. Monsters, you see, are real. Now Jimmy lives in fear, because he knows on Halloween, the monsters will come back. <laughs> I've been waiting all year for this. What do you want? said you were up here. Are you sleeping? It's only seven. Jimmy, are you okay? Hey, guy. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for what? For field testing my monster trap? I figure monsters are dumber than you, and since you fell for it. Um, is that a compliment or an insult? I don't know, and I don't care. I'm leaving. You've gotten really weird lately, Jimmy. I'm monster proof in my room for Halloween. We barely got away last time, but this year, I'm prepared. Okay, monsters can't stand the light, so I sleep with the lights on, and I made that flashlight trap. Number two, monsters like to sneak up on you, so I put balloons on the floor. When they pop, I know they're here. And finally, monsters hide under your bed and in your closet. So I removed the under from my bed, and I got rid of everything in my closet. Nothing for them to hide behind. So what do you do for clothes? Easy. <laughs> I just wear the same thing every day. Yeah. Hey, my motto is, better smelly than in a monster's belly. I thought we all agreed. Those weren't monsters last Halloween, just big kids trying to scare us. Yeah, and we deserved it for trying to scare Hannah. So you're friends with the baby now? She's not a baby. She's all right. Look, 
We were going over our Halloween plans. I've got a list of the houses that just give out full-size chocolate bars. We'll need our bikes, but I think the extra effort will be worth it. We need to avoid the taffy district and that cul-de-sac that gives out toothbrushes. Aren't you listening? When you celebrate Halloween, you just make the monster stronger. This year, we're boycotting Halloween. What? As group leader, I declare this Halloween canceled. You can't stop Halloween. You're just one kid. And I don't want to be part of any group that's anti-chocolate. You're either with me or against me. Fine. Be that way. Nah. Jimmy, don't say Satan. Your face might breathe that way. <sighs> yeah, yeah, Mom. Meanwhile, a few blocks away, our humble heroine, Hannah, was preparing for Halloween herself. Tag your end! No tag backs. Yeah, I was just in the neighborhood. I got a new kid, Davey, next door on my scaring route. So I thought I'd pop by and say boo. I'm glad you did. I'm waiting for Bert, Daryl, and Katie. They're picking up Jimmy, and we're going to plan our Halloween. It's going to be great. You're pals with them now? But they tried to scare you last Halloween. Aw, uh, they're okay. And what's a holiday without scares? <laughs> Arbor Day. Say, nice Halloween decorations. <laughs> You're going to give Scary Godmother a run for her money. <laughs> Thanks. I'm out of cobwebs, though. Oh, I'm sure Scary Godmother's got extra. This time of year, she's as busy as a mummy at a bandage sale. <laughs> but I'm sure she'd love to see you. You still got the key she gave you, right? Great. Well, got to go. That kid next door ain't going to scare himself. <laughs> Catch you later. Tonight on a new episode of Camp Laszlo, Raj gets a bite on his bottom, and it reveals the secret to a hidden treasure. The prophecy has been fulfilled. But there's more than gold hiding in the wilderness. The treasure. This is very suspicious. Now everyone's after Raj's rum. Ah, that was suspicious. It's a new episode of Camp Laszlo, tonight at 8 on Cartoon Network. Prepare yourself for a blockbuster-sized Totally Spies adventure. This could be like the most important loot mission ever. You know, besides the one where our mall was under attack. Clover, Sam, and Alex are graduating to super spy status. You've all been promoted. Promoted? What's the catch? And fighting their worst enemy. Behold, our very own army of evil Jerry's. Oh, is that redundant? <laughs> Presenting Totally Spies Undercover, an exclusive movie. Premiering Sunday at 8 on Cartoon Network. On August 9th, unleash the adventure. Somebody grab that dog. Unleash the laughs. Give me my pants back. Oh, that's a wedgie. Uh, no. Uh. And unleash the fun. Because of Win Dixie on DVD, August 9th. All right now, it's the big yellow taste of Kellogg's Corn Pops. As portrayed by a music video. Yeah, yeah. Pop sweet glaze goes bling like my ring. That sweet puffed crunch is tight like my limousine. So yellow and delicious. Are you feeling ambitious? But a taste that's so large, the cereal superstar. It's a pop spang, sweet crunchy bling bling. The cereal is the dealio. Big yellow taste, sweet puffed crunch. Part of this complete breakfast. You gotta have my pops. Imagine if everything were made by Willy Wonka. Everything is eatable. Wanna bring home the imagination of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? There are lots of ways with Wonka candy, like Wonka Bar and Nerds and Sweet Tarts, and especially new double chocolate Wonka Donuts. It'll be delicious. There's a golden opportunity waiting for you at Wonka.com, but ask your parents first. <laughs> 
Jill, you wanted scary godmother. Perfect. Oh, my leaves are done. Burnus interrupt us. They're making leaves. Oh, just baking them until they're red and gold and perfectly crispy, so they smell like fall and crunch just right when you jump into piles of them. You didn't think tree leaves changed on their own, did you? Actually, I did. The real trick is getting them all back on the trees. <laughs> Luckily, this year, the job goes to... Harry! You are not sleeping down there in Bugaboo's room when you've got work to do! <laughs> to work. Halloween is just around the corner. I was just downstairs uh, organizing and uh, alphabetizing your potions and notions and lotions and... Uh... Uh-huh. You've still got to paint the clouds into the sky. <sighs> for everyone here on the front side. Halloween's my favorite holiday, too. Of course it is, sweetie. With the creeps and treats, monsters and sweets, could you imagine anyone not loving Halloween? I hate Halloween. I hate, hate, hate Halloween. Jimmy, stop muttering to yourself. It's dinner time. And don't make those faces at dinner table. It'll get stuck that way. What are we having? Spaghetti and meatballs. Hey, my favorite! Oh, no! Go ahead. Eat me, Jimmy. Then on Halloween, I get to eat you! Now I can come back later. Aw, oh, Hannah, I'm never too busy for you. What do you need? <laughs> Scary dust? Magic cards? Boomstick <laughs> riding lessons? <laughs> no, I'm out of cobwebs. Voila! <laughs> These are great! Well, I'm no Black Widow, but I do what I can. <laughs> Oh, great! The decoration cupboard's locked and I don't have my skeleton key. Just Jimmy the lock. <gasps> Jimmy! I was supposed to call him. Scary Godmother, can I use your telephone? Sure, just use my cell phone. You won't eat me! Jimmy, stop playing. 
playing with your food. <laughs> Norway. What do you want, Squirt? We're all going to get pumpkins tomorrow. Gotcha! <laughs> do you want to come? No! I'm not coming to get pumpkins! Or you can't have Halloween without pumpkins. It was then that our Jimmy got himself an idea. A nasty, mean, selfish, devilish idea. Are you still there, Jimmy? Jimmy? If Halloween doesn't happen... The monsters can't get me. It's so simple. I'll just stop Halloween from coming. <laughs> Jimmy, what did I tell you about making faces? You stop it or your face will freeze like that. Oh, yeah, whatever. Huh? Uh oh. Jimmy doesn't want to get a pumpkin. But without a pumpkin on Halloween, you ain't got Jack's oh, lantern. Oh, I'm sure he'll find his Halloween spirit. Oh, company! Greetings! Hannah! Oh. Orson, are you okay? Yeah, I just forgot. You've got to invite us in. Ow! Does it hurt? Oh, nothing can really hurt me. Except the steak, or daylight, or holy water, or garlic, or... Hey, whoa, there are a lot of things that can hurt me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Come in, come in, please. Oh, king, queen, and prince of the night. Uh, we can't stay long. Max Orson and I are going to the grocery store, and knowing how busy you are, we wondered if we could get you anything. Well, if you could pick up a big jar of shrieks and a six-pack of frights, that'd be great. Done and done. What are you going to be for Halloween, Hannah? Mm, a veterinarian. Or an astronaut. Or a teacher. Maybe a superhero. Clown, pony trainer, acrobat, kitten, telemarketer, firefighter, or a ballet dancer. I'll see when I get to the store. How about you? What'll you be on Halloween? The same thing as every year. My little prince of the vampires. Ow! Mom! Halloween is an old time holiday requiring traditional formal clothing. No dungarees and tennis shoes. Ruby, my darling, you must show Hannah the coronation outfit that you are making for Orson. Oh, Hannah wouldn't be interested in my sketches. Yes, I would. Oh, no, she wouldn't. Oh, yes, I would. Please, Mom, don't. Wow. Very. Capy. Uh, do I have to wear that? I look like a dork in a crown. Yes, you will be the prince of dorkness. <laughs> what? Dorkness is not good? What is a dork? Can we just go? I'm dying of embarrassment. It is a bit late for that, son. Goodbye, Hannah. See you on Halloween. Bye! See you on Halloween, Orson? I guess so. I gotta go, too. I have to finish putting up decorations. Oh, Hannah, do you want to see my Halloween costume? Sure. Cool. Ta-da! I'm the Bone Ranger! <laughs> what do you think? Hi-ho, Silver! See you on Halloween? You know it. The party wouldn't be a party without you, Hannah. Let's do this. Those of you 
watching of a more sensitive nature may wish to turn away for this next graphic scene of horticultural violence. <laughs> Chore is finished, scary taskmaster. Have I finally paid my debt to society? We can't have Halloween. What's with the dramatic mood music? Harry, what did you do with the clouds? Oh. No, I just painted them. I swear, as a gentleman and an artiste. Winter's come early this year. I gotta make my Christmas cards. That's not Jack Frost nipping at our noses. Something's wrong. Really wrong. Black socks with sandals wrong. My jack-o'-lanterns! Don't worry, Carrie Godmother. I'll save the pumpkins. <laughs> Scully, put some muscle into it. I would! If I had any muscles! Oh. Let me help you! Hey! Hoogity! Hoogity! Maybe we should use another fruit or vegetable. How about lettuce? A jack of lettuce? Why not? Broccoli. Then we wouldn't have to eat it. Hey, guys, look. It's not broken. Someone just made the mouth for us. Cool. And it makes it easy to get the seeds out. Yeah, these pumpkins are better than ever. Everything seems back to normal for now, and congratulations, Bugaboo. That was a perfect strike. The worst costume is a pinata, because I need to be hit all the time. Oh, yeah, totally. They have pumpkins. Wait, what are they saying? The worst is candy corn. No way. The worst Halloween candy is black licorice. Ew. Well, any candy is fine by me. As long as you've got candy and costumes, you've got Halloween! Costumes and candy! Of course! It's the sweetest clan! <laughs> Ow! 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 Jimmy crept out into the night to continue his dastardly plan. If you're going out, bundle up. It's cold outside. But, Dad... Don't you butt me, young man. Put something on. <laughs> As I was saying, Jimmy crept out into the night to continue his dastardly plans. 
with electronic notes. Your own message or use over a thousand preset phrases. PTTH, talk to the hand. Write, pass, read, reply. Amy, want people later? I'm in. Me too. See you there. And your messages are safe. Not for you. Have the chip. Friendship's electronic message readers come two in a pack with four message chips. Batteries not included. Snap, crackle, and pop introduce the creamy taste of crumbled cookies, granola, and chocolate mixed together like never before. Kazam! It's the new Rice Krispies Kazam Crunch. With warriors chosen from time and space. Now, the ultimate battle has begun. and flammable? I don't know, but the stores can't sell candy and costumes that have been tampered with. They'll have to throw it all away. Even the chocolate caramels? Yes. The nut clusters? Yes, yes. The fruity wiggle worms and howler monkey choco pellets? Okay, you just made those up, but if they really existed, then yes, yes, yes. Oh, the candy is Dramatic music again. Oh, that's so not good. Listen up. We have a big problem. Oh, my coffee table. A scary godmother. Are you having an everything must go sale? Huh? Ah! Thank goodness I have no eyeballs. Treating. 
Well, we can still do the tricks. It'll be trick or trick. I guess I'm making your house this year, Daryl. Yeah, right. Duh. Of course. I got it. Thanks, Boozle. <laughs> I just had an idea. We don't have to buy treats. We can make our own. Make the treats? Sure. It's easy and fun. Here's what we could do. Hi, kids. Here's a treat that is easy to make and fun to eat. You'll need some large marshmallows, chocolate syrup, a chocolate bar broken into squares, graham crackers, and a toothpick. Take one square of chocolate and place it on two squares of graham cracker. Dip the toothpick into the chocolate syrup. Don't lose it in there. Paint a face on the marshmallow with the syrup. Put the marshmallow on top of the cracker. Add some hair, too. Put the whole thing into the microwave for 30 seconds or so, depending on your microwave. You want the chocolate square to get all softy. Watch his head puff up. Careful! It'll be hot when it comes out of the oven. Wait a few seconds until it's face to plate, and then chew them up. Mmm, gooey. Yeah, that'd work. You could even serve those at a party. That's a great idea, Katie. A Halloween party. A party? Yeah, that sounds good. But what do we do for costumes? We can make those too. We made our own last year, and they were great. Mine was pretty cool. Okay, homemade treats and costumes it is. But where can we have the party that everyone could fit? The Spook House! <laughs> Nothing can stop me! I am so smart! <laughs> oh, wow. You're invited to a Halloween party at the old Spook House. Hey, buddy! You're wearing your costume already? Good to see you have your Halloween spirit back. Will we see you at the party at the Spook House? Oh, I'll get there early. Extra early. Cool! See you there. Did he look creepy to you? It's Halloween. You're supposed to look creepy. True. This Halloween is gonna rock! Yay for Halloween! <laughs> is everyone okay? <sighs> Yes. There were just three of us, right? Ah, oh, no! Scary godmother! Oh, what a world! Hooray! My servitude has ended! It's enough to bring a creature to her! Halloween. Ah, uh, if only it were so, dear viewer. But alas, his dastardly plan to ruin Halloween was on a road. Do you get it? Toilet paper? Roll! <laughs> ah, Harry, truly you are a wolf with the wickedest wit in the West. <laughs> Let us see what chaos... Jimmy has wrought. Time. 
Halloween is ruined! Cats will over! Ruined! Cats will over! Holy jumping spiders! What is it? Do I have a bat in my hair? A rat? A fat cat? Is something wrong with Halloween on the calendar? Nope. Oh, good. There is no Halloween on the calendar! Oh, great boogity boogity! Chest? My heart? Oh, I am alive! Alive! Can we panic now? Uh, sure, why not? I think it's perfect! What are you talking about? It's supposed to be a spook house. Can't you see? The house and trees look like little ghosts. Zillions of little ghosts. Hannah's right. Look at them all. Cool. It's a real spook house now. We owe a big thanks to whoever did this. Oh, this will be the best Halloween. Everyone okay? Uh, except for this lumpy pillow I'm sitting on, I'm great. I'm no pillow, you idiot. Now get off me. <laughs> my whole life passed in front of my eyes. How was it? Fabulous. Max, awesome. My darlings, are you both all right? That awful beating in my chest is stopped. I'm fine, I'm fine. But it might have hurt my head. Maybe I should take it easy for a while and not wear any crowns or robes or anything. Looks like Hannah did it again! Halloween is safe! Okay, it's party time! We have the snacks and new costume! Yeah! Check it out! Last year I was a baseball player driving his SUV. This year I'm a baseball player driving an electric car. Yeah, even pro athletes gotta take care of the environment. Last year I was a cat. This year I'm a panther. Rawr! Oh, right, right. Well, last year I was a fairy princess. This year I'm a fairy queen. How about you, Daryl? I'm a piece of candy. That's what you were last year. But this year I'm sugar free. You said you had a surprise for us, Hannah? Yep. Are you ready for the best Halloween party ever? Yeah! yeah!
big prize, and there's still a chance to ruin Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> How much are you paying for internet service? $21? $23? Aren't you being charged too much? We think so. With People PC Online, you get unlimited internet access for only $10.95 a month. Go to PeoplePC.com now to try us free for 30 days and compare us with your current ISP. With People PC Online, you get internet service for less than half of what the big guys cost. And that's just the beginning. You also get more local access numbers than AOL, plus a smart dialer that automatically chooses the fastest, most reliable number. So you always get the best connection. All for just $10.95 a month. Try People PC Online free for 30 days and see for yourself. Go to PeoplePC.com for a quick three-minute download of our easy-to-use software. Or call 1-800-PEOPLE-PC. People PC Online, a better way to internet. Game Boy and Bags. Rated everyone. There's a place far away. Yeah, let's hit the beach in a big buggy. Where the play no flows and the dodos play in their beach buggy. Wow. On Dodo Island. Playing games of tiki tots. Yes. Surfing and fishing are cool. <laughs> dodos do what they want to do in the beach buggy. Each sold separately, dude. I want the photo, please! What's more fun than a photo booth full of friends? A photo booth you can take with you. My photo booth, instant fun for everyone. Set the timer, get ready, smile. My photo booth works with Polaroid iZone film, so it's a snap to create cool pictures. My photo booth, it's the picture of fun. New from Girl Pets. My photo booth comes with Polaroid iZone film. Other films sold separately. Batteries not included. Everywhere we go, people want to know who we are. So we tell them. We are tigers. We are tigers. Mighty, mighty tigers. Mighty, mighty tigers. Have you got what it takes to be a tiger? Work hard, eat right with Kellogg Frosted Flakes as part of a complete breakfast. And never stop earning your stripes. Sir, care to comment on these wacky packages? I'm outraged. Kids making fun of my products with these stickers. Look, baby bottle poop. That's just gross. <laughs> wacky packages rule. Next time on a new episode of Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. <laughs> I've heard of mobile phones, but this is ridiculous. Don't miss a new episode of Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. Tonight at 7 and 10.30. Only on Cartoon Network.
weren't. Hey, it's those kids that scared us last year. Man, they're good. I want to be as scary as them when I get big. You guys really scared us. You're so cool. <laughs> Did you hear that, Orson? This lad thinks that I am cool. <sighs> you have just made his century. What's in the jack-o'-lantern? It's the prize for the best costume. Ooh, and what treats is it filled with? Goblin cake? Booberry tots? I'm not sure. Scary Godmother said something about filling it with wolves' veins. <laughs> oh! oh, my dear girl, I believe they're playing our song. If you know how to do the bat tusi, <laughs> to the dance floor! Is there really wolf thing in there? No, it's sweet, sweetie. But if that walking hairball knew about them, there wouldn't be any left for the rest of us. Bird. How is it going? Do you want me to send your father down to help you with the doublet and breeches? I know there are many ribbons to tie. And the jerkin and trunk hose. Do not forget them. Wow, I love Halloween. Don't you, Count Max? Dressing up once a year as something you're not is so cool. Eh, uh, cool? Like... Well, I'm dressed as a fairy queen, and I'm usually just a girl. Or like Orson, he's always a prince of the night, and tonight he's... A prince of the night, ugh. Now this would make Orson look cool. I knew that! I am with it! I am cool! That dead old human said so earlier. Ruby, my precious corpusal, do not be so old-fashioned. Get with the century! It is Halloween, and now is not the time for him to dress as a prince. You are right. No matter how he looks on the outside, he is always a prince to us. Orson, come up and enjoy the party. Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Hannah. I owe you one. Boom! <laughs> Looks like you're saving everybody today. It was nothing. It was us that were almost nothing. You used your imagination and love of Halloween to save the day. And that's the greatest magic of all! Cornball! Thanks for letting my friends come to your party. I always say, the more the scarier! And now, for the moment you've all been waiting for, the winner of the best Halloween costume contest! <laughs> I'm so excited. And the winner of the grand prize is... <laughs> Where's the grand prize? Yes, the candy is mine. Halloween is ruined. <laughs> candy?
Mario Blake. I got it! Halloween. <laughs> bah, humbug. <laughs> oh, man. Now ah, you got me, kid. You gave me a great scare. <laughs> Tonight I'll have to check under my bed to see if you might be there. Put it there, pal. <laughs> What? Hey, everybody! I think we've got a winner here for best costume! Anyone who can scare Bugaboo deserves it! Hey, I did scare the scariest monster around, didn't I? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Everyone who thinks Jimmy should win best costume, scream! <laughs> Smash it open! Smash it? Would you help me, Anna? Sure. Glad you could make it, Jimmy. I wouldn't miss a Halloween party. Halloween rule! Ooh, did someone say there was candy? And so Halloween still had tricks and treats. And for Jimmy, revenge turned out to be very sweet indeed. And Scary and Hannah declared as they flew through the nights. Happy Halloween to all, and to all a good fright. <laughs> We hope you enjoyed our little Halloween special. Please remember, we can't do these without your support. So please send all your spare candy to Harry the Werewolf, care of Ackerman Forest, the Fright Side. Every little snack helps us bring you this quality programming. That does it! I also accept gift certificates, gift baskets, comic books, DVDs, CDs, data! Those little squishy candies with the cream inside. Oh, please. <laughs> Sorry about that, folks. <laughs> Thanks for watching.
10.30. Do you guys hear that? And Mandy finally smiles in an all-new Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy at 8.30 and 11. Bring it! <laughs> oh, and to celebrate that smile, Tommy and Tara display the fine art of body language. Chili dog, chili dog. And it's all here on Fridays, tonight, starting at 7. Right here on Cartoon Network. This Sunday on the Life and Times of Juniper Lee, June takes a break from magic to attend drama camp. Clang, 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 when... Thank you! I'm seeing... Thank you! Oh! Splendid! But not everyone is observing the holiday. It's Edipan, you idiot! You're supposed to be on vacation! I don't observe Edipan. It's not crazy about Labor Day, either. It's the Life and Times of Juniper Lee. Catch a new episode Sunday at 7.30, only on Cartoon Summer. Hubba Bubba Max, you're in lemonade. It's tart and it's sweet and it's sweet and it's hard. It just has it all and I chew it all the time, all the time. Let me tell you nonstop. Oh, yes, did I mention I chew it all the time? And when I'm not blowing bubbles, I'm thinking about blowing bubbles. Hubba Bubba Max. Hubba Bubba Max. Hubba Bubba Max. Hubba now your child can visit steamy jungles, grassy plains, and the dark depths of the oceans to meet and learn surprising facts about the magnificent animals that live there, all through the captivating, colorful pages of Zoo Books. The publication is specially created for young readers. Each monthly issue of Zoo Books is packed with breathtaking full-color photos and scientifically accurate illustrations, plus games and puzzles. Today, through this exclusive TV offer, you can get 12 fascinating issues of Zoo Books for the special price of $19.95. When you call and use your credit card, we'll include the elephant's issue as a gift. Plus, you'll also get the colorful collection of animal stickers and the tiger poster. So order Zoo Books today and send learning and fun to a child you love. To order 12 fascinating issues of Zoo Books for $19.95, call 1-800-441-2400. When you call, we'll include the bonus elephant issue, stickers, and tiger poster with your order. Call 1-800-441-2400. You must be 18 years or older to call. My name is Willy Wonka. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory is the best movie of the year. Wow! Johnny Depp's delicious take on Willy Wonka demands to be seen, says Rolling Stone. Everyone enjoy yourselves. Johnny Depp. But just don't touch anything. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. A Tim Burton film rated PG. Huh? Huh. What was that? What the? Oh, my God. What the? Oh! Ego home style waffles. So crispy on the outside, so fluffy on the inside, you won't be able to leave them alone. The irresistible part of this complete breakfast. Introducing Twizzler Sours. Chewy bits of Twizzler sprinkled with sour crystals. <laughs> They're zany. They're Twizzlers. They're sours. I've got the power to choose what's in my McDonald's Happy Meal. McDonald's Happy Meal choices let me choose something new every time I go there. your child's day like their favorite songs. I'm a little deeper. Now Time Life Music brings you a new collection. 100 best love songs for kids for just $24.99. One hundred songs for kids on four CDs or four cassettes for just twenty-four ninety-nine. One hundred songs for kids. If you're not completely satisfied, Time Life will refund every penny of your purchase price. So call now for one hundred songs for kids. Call one eight hundred five nine two three three eight eight to order one hundred songs for kids for twenty-four ninety-nine plus shipping.
there's only one kind of candy I'm interested in. <sighs> I just want to find my knight in shining armor. Well, well, well. <laughs> Looks like Discount Costume Mart had a clearance sale. <laughs> Mine, a designer original by fashion goddess Donna Roberto. Uh, looks like your designer original is falling apart there, Queen Tut. Ah. Hey! No! Ah. Oh. <laughs> you won't pay for that! Both financially and figuratively! Ah. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Way to go, Staminator! Hasta la vista, Mandy! Ciao! Oh, hi, Mom. But, uh, how? I... Uh, okay. What was that all about? My mom's best friend's son, Chucky. The most bratty, awful... Uh, a cute, adorable little kid you ever saw? And we're going to babysit him tonight. Yay! <laughs> Yay, babysitting? I thought you wanted to go to a party. What about trick-or-treating? We'll have our own party. And then we can go trick-or-treating with Chucky. Come on, guys. It'll be fun. They live in that hot new development, Vista Verde Estates. Hmm. Vista Verde Estate. Hmm. Please, I can't do this alone. Fine. Okay. Uh, where's Jerry? Ooh. <laughs> Scared you, didn't I? I'm going to my first Halloween party this evening. So? What do you think? I think you've finally lost it. Ah, now that's why I called you here. <gasps> Perhaps you could help me choose another. You mean, there's no mission? A mission? Oh, heavens no. So, you don't like my Elizabeth. But how about Mary, Queen of Scots? Huh? Uh, Jer, guys usually go with something scary, like a monster or a ghost. Hmm. Or a clown. On second thought, stay as you are. You're scary enough to me. Thank you, girls. Hmm, yes, food for thought. Well, before you go, Gladys wanted to give you a head start on your treat or tricking. <gasps> we get candy? For Sam, some chewy fun bubblegum. <gasps> a pixie stick for my little pixie, Alex. And for Clover... A box of Belgian chocolate truffles with hazelnut ganache? Candy corn, the perennial Halloween favorite. If by favorite you mean least favorite, I'd have to agree. <laughs> Clover! Hi, Mrs. Vanderfleet. And are these your little friends? Hi, I'm Sam and this is Alex. Well, come on in. Chucky's just so excited to see you all. Nobody humiliates me and gets away with it. Ah. Ghosts of Beverly Hills. Spirit below, rise from your slumber. Leave your grave, turn the earth under, blot out the moon with your dark hand, wander hungrily across this land. Come on, I'm gonna be late for the rave! of Palm. Boutiques on Rodeo for my mom. Take this coffee that is French roast. Make Sam and Alex fear the most. Make Clover freak out worst of all. When zombies rise and, and raid them all. Like terror that they've never seen. Curse these girls on Halloween. <sighs> well, spirits, zombies, the undead, somebody, hello? Ugh! You want something done right, you have to do it yourself. Glorious hours away from that little nightmare.
was thinking about getting a satellite dish. Guess who's responsible for the equipment? Me. 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 Say my receiver breaks. My LMB breaks. You know, that thingy at the end of the arm. There's no local office. I have to ship it back to the manufacturer. It could take up to three weeks. No TV. Meanwhile, I'm still paying for programming. And guess who pays for the repairs? Me. 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 Time Warner Digital Cable. There really is no better choice. At Erie Homes for Children and Adults, we assist people with disabilities to live rich and fulfilling lives. We provide programs which challenge individual potential and meet the needs of the people we serve. Our programs include Project First Step, Life Sharing Through Family Living, School Age, Options, Respite, Group Homes, Move. For more information, call EHCA, Erie Homes for Children and Adults at 454-1534. It's the Fantastic Four. They've got fantastic powers. Super Stretch Mr. Fantastic can stretch up to three times his size and go to any length to defeat the evil Dr. Doom. Let's go for a spin, Doom. Super Stretch Mr. Fantastic stretches up to three times his size. Here we go. Quiet down, Groot. One fruit-flavored snack. Three tasty twists of cherry flavor that can only mean one thing. New Cherry Explosion Fruit Twistables is here. And he's ripe for some action. You go, Cherry Explosion! Three explosive cherry twists in one. New Cherry Explosion Fruit Twistables. Get some fruit snack with a twist. New Nestle Teen Titans Hero Pops. How heroic will they make you feel? Perhaps able to run like a cheetah. Or maybe fly like an eagle. Guys, could I get a hand? Or even the power to be... Guys. Invisible? One heroic team, four heroic flavors. New Teen Titans Hero Pops. One of the many ways to give your summer some juice from Nestle. Right now, you're watching Totally Spies on Maguzi. Then, the Teen Titans are ready for their next adventure. Later, it's all your favorite pretend pals on Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. Wait a minute, where's Chucky? Chucky! Huh? huh? Hello? Hello? Cheap cell phone service much. Ah! <laughs> I scared you. That was so funny. I got you good. <gasps> Isn't he cute? I want candy. I want to go trick or treating. 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 better than choco balls if someone gives you choco balls can i have them uh, only if you give me your jelly goose deal mm. hey how come we're the only ones out trick-or-treating huh trick-or-treat 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 what's going on they're probably just out of candy let's go I'll show them sunny side up. No! Uh, you behave, you hear me, young man? My mom said you can't tell me what to do. <gasps> That's weird. That's <gasps> even weirder. Cool. Hey, maybe it's true. Maybe what's true? The legend of Vista Verde Estate. Urban legend. This place was built on an ancient, evil, scary place with a gateway that lets in zombies and creepazoids. <gasps> Chucky, those are just silly stories. <laughs> <gasps> what is it? There's someone in the. Oh, here we go again with the stories. There's a crazy creepazoid in the house. <laughs> yeah. Alex, come on. Hello? It's 
that weird cell phone again. I think. It's probably just the house settling. And if it's not... <gasps> or something. phone calls were a dead giveaway. What cheesy phone calls? Uh. <gasps> Listen, I don't know who this is, but... I know where you are. Is that you, Todd? Jazz? Jason? Well, my work here is done. I've got a rad Halloween rave to hit. It's been a real slice. Lot. I can't believe it! 
She so deserves to be mauled by the ghoulazoids. We can't leave her. Mandy might be the only one who knows how to get rid of these things. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have deducted my moving expenses last year. I... Well, was your new job at least 50 miles farther from your old home than your old home was from your old job? What? Are you some kind of tax expert? Well, I did take the H&R Block income tax course. You know anything useful about student loans? Well, of course. You know, I'm never sure if I should itemize or not. Oh, it depends on your situation. Hey, how would you like to go out for dinner and a little tax talk? H&R Block can teach you to handle taxes like a pro. Sign up for the H&R Block income tax course today. You don't miss a single deduction, do you? Do you have the number for H&R Block? Well, sure. Oh! Fine. Classes start soon in your area. Call now. Hello, H&R Block? Hello? I really need that class.
not. It's just too powerful. Hold on, spies. We're coming to get you. Ah! They got the power! The mindless ghouls, they're pretty smart. We can't go back. We've got to save Clover and Chucky now. And Mandy. Well, I guess since we'll already be there. Hey! Huh? They cut the power right here. Can we reconnect it? I don't think so. But we can do something better. Perfect. It's made of rubber, so we can grab the cables? Bow down before your master. Dracula cool. Dracula? Oh, no. This is just an overcoat. What do you say? Uh, uh, we say we're glad Halloween only comes once a year. <laughs> I just love watching horror movies, even though I don't get spooked easily. Like in the mall that dripped blood. I didn't even jump when the girl is closing up for the night, and she hears creaks in the back of the designer's shoe department, and so she goes there alone. And we hear the loud breaths of something moving closer, like ready to pounce, and then the power goes off, and she can't see a thing, and... <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Torch mask and gloves. Slam on! Loaded with the sounds and missile firing action of the Human Torch. I am the Human Torch! Human Torch mask and glove set, each sold separately. Hot Wheels! Get ready for stunts! Get ready for jumps! The Mega Air Jumper is on the run! Just watch it leap! Jump and do damage with a crash! Punch and watch it land with the beam! Thump! Always ready for a new stunt! Yeah! You better be ready to leave the ground Cause the Mega Air Jumper's gonna rock your town The official monster jam Mega Air Jumper Vehicles each sold separately Hot Wheels drive to survive Peekaboo, 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 peekaboo Come on, peekaboo Only Huggies Natural Care Baby Wipes Oh, come on, it's easy Our plushy peekaboo thick for a feel-good clean mm, That's not bad Hooray for Huggies! Mm, for a mom Where'd she go? <laughs> Come back here! I see sold separately. Now you can team up Star and Lightning Bolt Chicken Tenders with Fantastic Four Toys. They love them! Awesome! There are five action 
compact toys you can collect. There's one in every kid's meal, only at Burger King. What do you know about computers? My daughter definitely knows how to use a computer better than I do half the time, <laughs> and she's three and a half. Hi, I'm John Scherer, CEO and founder of Video Professor. You know, I've been hearing comments like that for over 14 years now. Listen to this. I did the Excel, and it was, it was a lot of fun. Really? I had a real good time. I learned a lot. The difference? Just an hour with one of my CDs, and they're easy to use. The CD plays like a video on your computer screen. Just follow the step-by-step -step instruction. If you call now, I'll send you one free. You just pay a small shipping and handling. Now, the reason I'll do this is because I know that once you try my product, you'll come back to us for all your computer learning needs. You know, if you can't learn, I'll even refund your shipping and handling. So, learn a new skill in less than an hour. Try my product. I think that's the most fun I've had learning something about the computer. To get your free computer learning CD, you must call now. Call 1-800-829-8866. school teacher Ichabod Crane was never seen again. And so ends Washington Irving's classic tale, The Legend of Sleepy Hollow. A perfect tale for the day before Halloween, wouldn't you say, class? And aren't we lucky? Our new Sleepy Hollow Museum even has Irving's original manuscript from 1819, perfectly preserved. Pretty cool. Yeah! Irving really steeped himself in the spooky legends of the region before he wrote his story. I meant the case, Kate. It's totally airtight and kept at a constant temperature. Pretty cool. No, what's really cool, Nick, is that the legend of Sleepy Hollow is not just a story. Parts of it are said to be true and based on real people of the time. That's an interesting theory, Kate. Thanks, Mrs. Wentworth. I've done a lot of reading. So, for all we know, you, Nick Crane, could be a distant relative of Ichabod Crane. <laughs> That's just another one of Kate's theories. But it's totally bogus. I mean, I'm no scaredy cat like old Ichabod was. Ah! I'd say I just proved Kate's theory conclusively, Nickabod Crane. Tucker, I am not related to Nickabod... I mean, Ichabod Crane. 
<laughs> then, then how come you're so jumpy? <laughs> Maybe you can scare all of us, Tucker, tomorrow at school with your entry in the most scary pumpkin contest. So let's get busy. And the haunted house still needs a lot of work. Don't worry, Nick and I are on it. It'll be the scariest place in town, except for old Castle Van Tassel. Bye! Bye! Finally, Grunk, they're gone. Yeah, Leo. Now this is pretty cool, Nick. Yeah, I had to disassemble my remote control miniature mirror space station to make it, but no problem. You think that spider is creepy? Wait till I get this zombie put together. Too bad we don't have any music to make monsters by. You've thought of everything! out of the graveyard. Yeah, that green jelly from the cafeteria is kind of unearthly. Especially when smeared all over the skeleton from the biology lab. It ought to make the haunted house a howling success. Yeah, we just forgot one thing. We still need to carve a scary pumpkin for the pumpkin contest. Hey, there's still plenty of time to buy a nice big one. After we wash off the slime. Huh? 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 Crane! I come for you! Huh? Yikes! Huh? <gasps> 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 You've seen a ghost! Worse! Look! What? It's the ghost of the Headless Horseman! And it's real! Yikes! Real disappointing. Very funny, Tucker. You should have seen Nicobod's face! 
Nick, it's just Tucker trying to be cute. Oh, I am cute. <sighs> Nick? Hey, hey, knew it all along. Nice touch with the goggles, though, Tuck. Knew it all along? Yeah, right. I've never seen anybody so scared. Right, Kate. The haunted house is gonna be a screaming success. <laughs> what? He wasn't too pleased with our window cleaning job, Grunk. <laughs> yeah, we cleaned the place out good and properly, yo. <laughs> Can I plan a brilliant heist or what? Mm. Uh. It's empty. We're out of gas. I thought I told you to fill it up yesterday. Uh, I forgot. Uh. Stop! Uh, I hope you didn't forget how to run! Ah. Stop! Thieves! Come back here! One simple solution. Amazing. Credit acceptance in less than 30 seconds. Ask us about our guaranteed credit approval at Township Automotive. Call today, 814-833-9100. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, the video game, is your golden ticket to the tremendous, marvelous Willy Wonka Factory. Come along for a delicious adventure. Let's boogie. And use your incredible candy powers to earn the Oompa Loompa's respect and win Wonka's amazing factory. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, the video game, rated E for everyone. Strawberry explosions coming at ya. Danimals XL. Made large for living large. Chill. Danimals XL. Excellent. Cannonball! Shobu is the son of a great kaiju monster. Is his success in the cards as well? Are you ready? Bring it on! Duel Masters. Weekday mornings at 6. You've got to play to win on Cartoon Network. You know, back at the school, 
you didn't really think I was scared, did you? Because I wasn't. Don't worry about it. That Tucker is such a goofball. Yeah, right. We ought to be able to find a good pumpkin here. I should have been riding in comfort, not doing the sleepy hollow marathon. Ooh, ooh. Ooh. Watch where you're going, Grunk. This manuscript is almost 200 years old, and it's gonna be worth plenty to us. Uh, uh, sorry, Leo, but that guard is a lot faster than he looks. Stop! Both of you! Well, I'm a lot smarter than I look. We just need a place to hide our loot. Perfecto. We can come back and pick this up. After we've given that guard the slip. Now, help me cover this pumpkin up. <sighs> Nobody steals a manuscript from under my nose. They're all so small. <sighs> Kate, this is the third stand we've been to. I know, I know, but we need a really humongous pumpkin. You know, the biggest pumpkins grow wild. We could try that old pumpkin patch deep in the woods. The woods? Uh, looks like it could rain. Hmm, I mean, you're the expert, Kate. Lead on. Uh, why are we walking backwards, Leo? Well, if you must know, it's so that the guard won't realize we've doubled back here. Pretty smart, huh? That's why I'm the brains of this outfit. Ah, ow! And that's why you're the brawn! Come on. Now, we'll just pick up our loot and... Oh, the guard! Hide! Bingo! We've got a much better selection than those stands. Wow, you were right, Kate. This is Pumpkin Central. I'll find us a nice big one. Hey, that's not the guard. Shh! I can see that. We'll just have to wait till they leave to retrieve our loot. No, nope. Uh-uh. You called that a pumpkin? Whatever. How about this one? Please. Fine, Kate. Tell you what, I'll just sit over here until you find the perfect pumpkin. Ow! I think I just found it. I'll say, now that's a pumpkin. Good work. Uh, don't mention it. Hmm, maybe it is gonna rain. That does it. Those kids ain't getting our pumpkin. What are you kids doing out here all alone? Looking for a pumpkin. Hey, aren't you the guard from the museum? Yeah, soon to be ex-guard. Two thieves posing as window washers stole the Sleepy Hollow manuscript. Hmm. And they even did a lousy job on the windows. That's terrible. Tell me about it. I'm gonna lose my job for having the museum robbed right under my nose. Is there anything we can do? No, let a professional handle this. Hey, right. Let a professional handle this, Kate. <sighs> Too bad we couldn't have helped that poor museum guard. I'm sure he'll catch him, Kate. You want to carve this guy, or should I? I'm glad I caught you two before I left. This haunted house stuff looks pretty impressive. You ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> Very 
Impressive. I can hardly wait to see what the rest of the class thinks of it. Well, Tucker was certainly impressed. I can imagine. Good luck with your pumpkin. Don't stay too late. We won't, Mrs. Wentworth. Let's get started. Great! I'll draw the face! Huh? What? Did you do that? Me? Uh-uh, no way. Maybe it was Tucker trying to scare me again. Not that I'm scared. Well, it's spooking me. Let's put it in the window. Hey, Grunk, isn't that our pumpkin? Uh, I don't know. Somehow it looks scarier than our pumpkin. Well, I intend to get it back and the manuscript inside it. Come on. Ooh. Climb up, scare the kids, then grab the pumpkin. Whoa! It's me, you dunderhead. Whew! I was scared. Nah, you're scary. Now let's get you fixed up. Uh, Leo, it's dark. Okay, so what do you think is making it glow? I don't know. Phosphorescence from the field? Maybe we should dissect it. Or maybe not. Did you see that? It was hard to miss. I'm gonna take a picture of it. Careful, Kate. Please, don't harm me! Calm down! Guess ectoplasm doesn't show up on film, Kate. But that means he's a real... a... G ghost! Of course I'm a ghost lad. It's <gasps> Halloween Eve, is it not? The night all ghosts get to roam. But I've never seen one like that horrible creature in there. Scary! Anyway, I cannot tarry. I daren't be around when the Headless Horseman comes back for his head. Things shall get really ugly for you live ones. You may be ectoplasm, but that's just a pumpkin. Wrong. Huh? It's a haunted uh -huh. pumpkin. As sure as my name is Nathaniel Wiley, who lived and died at the Battle of White Plains. Wow! Washington Irving mentioned that battle in his tale of the Headless Horseman. Hmm. <laughs> What does a rider know? Let me tell you the true story of that horseman. He was a Hessian, a merciless mercenary soldier who made a deal with dark forces so he would be unbeatable. Luckily, some of the revolutionary elders knew magic of their own. The Hessian was defeated and beheaded. <gasps> and his head magically turned into a pumpkin. And so it has remained for centuries. End of story. Right? Wrong. <gasps> Today is the anniversary of his death. If the pumpkin is placed on the Headless Horseman's shoulders, at the stroke of midnight on Halloween Eve, the evil Hessian will live again, wholly unstoppable. I knew that Irving's story was based on fact. I'm glad you're happy. But this sounds pretty bad. Aye, bad it is, lad. But the Hessian only has one chance. Puts that pumpkin on his neck at exactly the stroke of midnight, and not one second after. It will retransform into his real head. And the evil creature will stalk the earth once more. Ugh, oh, that can't be good, Nathaniel. Hey, look on the bright side, guys. All we have to do is keep the pumpkin away from the headless horseman till after midnight. We? 
Gee, I don't know. You look so familiar, lad. You remind me of a school teacher named Ichabod Crane. A nervous, timid, fidgety sort. You wouldn't be related to him by any- No! Okay, we're gonna keep that pumpkin out of the horseman's hands. The school doors are locked from the inside anyway. That should keep us safe until- Nick! Oh! No! But you said there was just one headless horseman. <gasps> We've got to get out of here. around here is you! This thing is fake! So what's the deal with the two headless horsemen? <sighs> I guess you're in bigger trouble than I thought. But you're gonna help us stop them, right? Well... Uh... A hero of the Battle of White Plains? Chickening out? Of course I'll help! What have I got to lose? I'm already dead! Oh, stop your moaning and get a grip, Crunk! Those kids tricked us and got away with our pumpkin! Oh, let them have it, Leo. It's just a pumpkin. The manuscript is inside, pumpkin head! Oh, yeah. Why didn't you say so? <laughs> they won't get away for long. You're running on the street, Kate. But it'll be easier to lose those headless horsemen in these woods. <sighs> ah! Ah! If we don't end up headless first... This is all the Hessian's doing. He wants to hold you till he can come claim his head. Yeah, well he needs to catch us first. Die! Ah! Let go! <laughs> Okay, so maybe the woods wasn't such a good idea, but we need a place to hide out with the pumpkin till after midnight. Got any ideas? Yes! Old Castle Van Tassel has plenty of places to hide. Uh, I don't know about that, Kate. That place is creepy even in the daylight! Not scared, are you? Me? No way, never! I, uh, I was just thinking of poor Nathaniel's nerves! Oh! <laughs> Let's get out of here! Scooby-Doo Spooky Nemesis. Are you just looking for a good monster-free walk? Well, have I got something for you. It's the Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation's Walk to Cure Diabetes. You'll have fun while helping to find a cure. So parents call 1-88-533-WALK or visit JDRF.org for more information. And relax, I won't be there. Jeez. Cartoon Network encourages kids to get active, get inspired, and get animated. Master Lemony, it's tart and it's sweet and it's sweet and it's hard. It just has it all, and I chew it all the time, all the time. Let me tell you, nonstop. Oh yes, did I mention I chew it all the time? And when I'm not blowing bubbles, I'm thinking about blowing bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> Got it. 
A1 steak sauce. Yeah, it's that important. What do you know about computers? My daughter definitely knows how to use a computer better than I do half the time, <laughs> and she's three and a half. Hi, I'm John Scherer, CEO and founder of Video Professor. You know, I've been hearing comments like that for over 14 years now. Listen to this. I did the Excel, and it was, it was a lot of fun. I had a real good time. I learned a lot. The difference? Just an hour with one of my CDs, and they're easy to use. The CD plays like a video on your computer screen. Just follow the step-by-step -step instruction. If you call now, I'll send you one free. You just pay a small shipping and handling. Now, the reason I'll do this is because I know that once you try my product, you'll come back to us for all your computer learning needs. You know, if you can't learn, I'll even refund your shipping and handling. So, learn a new skill in less than an hour. Try my product. I think that's the most fun I've had learning something about the computer. To get your free computer learning CD, you must call now. Call 1-800-829-8866. <laughs> Let's try not to lose them, shall we? Oh, hey, watch it, you clumsy oaf! Uh, um, I didn't do nothing. Ah, never mind. Just follow me. Uh. Ooh. Oh. Hey, I said follow me. I'm the leader of this outfit. Uh, maybe those trees have stopped moving by now. Don't be silly. We just hide here for a few more hours and it'll be all over. Yeah, that's what I'm afraid of. This is Castle Van Tassel? In my time, it was an opulent place. Old Baltus Van Tassel was so proud of his pricely possessions and rare artifacts. Unfortunately, his relatives lost all his money in the stock market crash of 1929. <sighs> Kate's an expert on old Sleepy Hollow history. <sighs> Too bad I'm not an expert at old Sleepy Hollow locks. This thing is stuck. Ugh. No. Ugh. Phew. Ugh, that is too bad. Looks like we'll have to find another place to hide from the headless horseman. It was just the wind. I'm not shaking. It's just the Nathaniel is a real heavy. Heavy? I'm in material, lad. I'm a ghost. See? Whoa, incoming! Look out! Oh. Go! Uh. I once parried a musket ball with my short sword and have a dent to prove it. Nanga! On guard! I bayonets, is it? No matter, me lad. Victory is ours! I have battled the bat like the Battle of White Plains. Enemy is vanquished. Let's go! Place certainly is deserted. Ah, but when the Van Tassels were alive, the castle was filled with party goers. Now to find a good place to hide. Uh, uh, did someone say deserted? 
It's been <gasps> so long <gasps> since we had guests. We never get visitors. <laughs> Tonight we ghosts can strut our stuff We're happy to appear We hope we scare you quite enough We're here to spread good fear Wake up you lazy dentists Get yourselves in gear We ghosts have guests so please look alive Sometimes our guests survive Wake up, you lazy deadheads. Your mission is quite clear. We ghosts have guests, so please look alive. And if you faint, who knows if you'll revive? <laughs> you could have stayed outside. Yes, we suppose. We hope these iron feet don't cross your little toes. <laughs> Night for dancing, oh, so supernaturally. <laughs> Don't look dead. Keep up your feet, my dear. We ghosts have guests, so please look alive. Let's try to keep our visitors terrified. We ghosts have guests, so please look alive. You never danced so well before you die. Ghosts, what's next? You're cheating. Am not. Nothing up my sleeve. Did you see that? Well, uh, yeah. Why are you taking his side? Because anyone with eyes in his head can see that you're a cheat. Am not. I too. Uh, we gotta go. So there you are. I thought I'd never shake that spider. Ah! Uh, you... Is he your friend? Uh, no harm done. Yeah, you can start over. Not after 300 years. What are you doing with that card? Are you cheating too? Cheating? I wasn't even playing! I say he's cheating! Me too! Uh, gotta go! Scoundrels! Get them! <laughs> nice try, Nickabod. But I did the Headless Horseman trick first. What a copycat. Well, I'm not scared and I'm not moving. must have gone to fight school. It's them. Our manuscript is inside. Let's go. This is not good, Kate. We not only have the Headless Horseman to keep the pumpkin away from, but... I know. We have to play keep away from a bunch of ghosts. <gasps> not the lead feet again. Uh, this way. <laughs> We didn't have to make a haunted house at school. We could have brought the class here. 
I say we take our chances outside. Leaving so soon? <gasps> How rude. We just won't hear of it. We haven't even begun to scare you. Everything were made by Willy Wonka. Everything is eatable. Wanna bring home the imagination of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? There are lots of ways with Wonka candy, like Wonka Bar and Nerds and Sweet Tarts, and especially new double chocolate Wonka Donuts. It'll be delicious. There's a golden opportunity waiting for you at Wonka.com, but ask your parents first. What do you know about computers? My daughter definitely knows how to use a computer better than I do half the time, <laughs> and she's three and a half. Hi, I'm John Shear, CEO and founder of Video Professor. You know, I've been hearing comments like that for over 14 years now. Well, listen to this. I did the Excel, and it was, it was a lot of fun. Really? I had a real good time. I learned a lot. The difference? Just an hour with one of my CDs, and they're easy to use. The CD plays like a video on your computer screen. Just follow the step-by-step -step instruction. If you call now, I'll send you one free. You just pay a small shipping and handling. Now, the reason I'll do this is because I know that once you try my product, you'll come back to us for all your computer learning needs. You know, if you can't learn, I'll even refund your shipping and handling. So, learn a new skill in less than an hour. Try my product. I think that's the most fun I've had learning something about the computer. To get your free computer learning CD, you must call now. Call 1-800-829-8866. On the next all-new episode of Zatch Bell. Better leave this one to us. Keo and Zatch have their hands full with Baltro. He's got us, Keo. What do we do now? Sting seems to be in control. You ain't seen nothing yet. But who's really pulling the strings here? Huh? Come on. An all-new episode of Satch Bell. Saturday night at 9.30. Ah! Flower power my foot. <laughs> Only Toonami. <laughs> Rats. What? <laughs> hey, are you okay? Great costume, but it must be hard to see where you're riding, kid. Well, you're a night early, but I guess you deserve some candy for that outfit. Well, let's see. All I have are some breath mints. Here, trick or treat. Listen, you didn't happen to see a pair of window washers running through the woods, did you? Well, if you should see them, tell them this guard's hot on their trail, and he's gonna catch them! We need to find a hiding place now! I spy one! Thanks a lot, Nathaniel! Sorry! Nathaniel! We could use some help here! Revolutionary war hero? There is no call. 
call for insults, lass. Yikes! I did? Uh, I mean, of course I did. I knew you would. <gasps> the pumpkin! Where's the pumpkin? I think it's trying to get away. And it's doing a pretty good job. Oh! Ah! <laughs> oh, it's just those kids trying to scare us. But I'm gonna give them the scare of their lives. Then I'll get their pumpkin and get our manuscript, and we'll be rich. <laughs> uh oh. Hey, if I were you, I'd hide that pumpkin, cause it's really the headless Hessian's head. The beast who scared of Ichabod Crane and left her daughter Katrina to marry that lout, Brom Bones? Really, dear, calm yourself. Remember your blood pressure. It was the death of you. I want this thing out of here at once! <laughs> Thank you. I'll be leaving now. No! Kate! I dare not look. I feared this would get ugly. Whoa! Ah! Yeah! Oh! Yikes! Oh! I, I got, got it! it. I deserve a big fat raise! <sighs> okay, okay, forget about the raise. <gasps> oh. Man, how many headless horsemen are there around here? Uh, I count three. Well, I say they can't all be real. I'd go with the one on the zombie horse. <gasps> Definitely the one on the zombie horse. Right, which leaves us with just one headless ghost. <laughs> the headless horseman! Uh, okay, okay, here you go, boss. Crunk! Huh? You fool! What are you doing? I'm over here! Uh, th then who is this? And where'd he get the horse? <laughs> Ah! 
Foul Fiend! Let's get it, Grump! Ah. 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 Oh. 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 Thought you'd get away, eh? I'd say you window washers are washed up! Now hand over the manuscript. Oh. 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 Ah. Faster, Kate! Faster! Ah. Kate, let him go! Nick! Let me go! Kate! He wants his head, lad. He's waited centuries for this. Nick, don't give it to him! <sighs> Go, you headless freak! Nick, no! It's midnight! <gasps> <gasps> it's all over! I dare not look! Yeah, for him! <laughs> Clock Tower may say it's midnight, but my GPS synchronized watch is never wrong. It's actually 12.01! Oh, Nick! You're a smart lad. I always knew ye had it in you. <gasps> Bravo! Well done! What a perfect end to a perfectly frightening party. Aye, we have vanquished the foul fiend. Come, dear. This shall be the most joyous Halloween at Castle Van Tassel since you've been alive. Wow! They look pretty darn happy for ghosts! Yeah, now that the Headless Horseman is gone forever. But at least we still have our pumpkin. And he looks really happy to be rid of that Hessian, too. <gasps> it's the missing Washington Irving manuscript! No wonder those crooks were after this pumpkin! You know what something like this is worth? I don't know, but we could try an online auction. Hmm. Just kidding, Katie. I know it's priceless. And it should go back in its temperature control case. Don't worry. I'll put it back where it belongs, and put these two where they belong. In jail. Oh, oh, oh. I ain't sharing a cell with him. Thanks for finding this, you two. Sometimes even a professional needs a little help. Nice costume, kid. Here's a mint. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Halloween! Ghosts, do not eat candy. Well, you deserve something, Nathaniel. We couldn't have done it without your help. On the contrary, you were the brave ones. Especially you, lad. You might look like old Ichabod, but there can't be any relation, because you have too much courage. Uh, well, Kata, I am distantly related to Ichabod Crane on my father's side. I knew it! But why didn't you tell me sooner? Because till now there was nothing much to brag about. But you know, I think I showed the true Crane colors tonight. What's the matter, Tucker? Don't you want to go into the haunted house? I think he saw enough of that monster last night, Mrs. Wentworth. Well, I think you two did a great job on it. Oh, yeah? Well, they did a really lousy job on their pumpkin. 
I mean, they're never gonna win the scary pumpkin contest. This happy pumpkin is totally unscary. <laughs> no! You think? Uh, I beg to differ. How'd you do that, Nick? Sorry, trade secret, right, Kate? Right, Nick. County Fair is here. Don't miss the seven days of sizzling summer fun this week at the fairgrounds in Dunkirk. Head to J&J's Monster Midway and ride the mechanical rides all day. You'll love the motorsports madness at the Budweiser Grandstand with new shows and more fun than ever before. See all of this year's exciting new entertainment and your fair favorites at the Arthur R. Maidem Family Theater. Get to the fair and register to win a laptop computer. It's the Chautauqua County Fair. Get there! Um, is the Super Banana Bomb Pop made of real bananas? Hey, wait, this is tofu! The only chocolate bar with real M&M &M minis. And crunchy and peanut butter. Amazing. Are you? Dippity. Uh-oh, my first bath. Uh, it'll be okay, right? You do have a PhD in, in baby washing, don't you? Oh, wait, what's this? You're washing me with one hand and holding me with another. Wow, I'm, I'm impressed. That's something else, you're good. Huggies introduces disposable washcloths with extra gentle built-in baby wash. I never doubted you, really. <laughs> what a relief. I came into a smart family. doo-wop show of all time. A night full of unforgettable oldies. Presenting the doo-wop gold video collection. From the Cadillacs to the Duke of Earth. Get doo-wop gold on VHS or DVD for just $19.99. But if you call now with your credit card, we'll cut the price in half. You get 21 performances for just $9.99. Then preview other great doo-wop videos. Satisfaction guaranteed. Call 1-800-829-8866 to order doo-wop gold for just $9.99 plus shipping when you use your credit card. Call now or order online at timelife.com. Starting next week. Begin. It's new cars. Go like more swords. Attack is new duels. Now come get me. New battlegrounds. Dragon sword. And new adventures. Intercept. Say what? It's new episodes of Yu-Gi-Oh. Starting next week, Monday through Thursday at 9:30 on Cartoon Network. All this week, Maguzi's got episodes of the Teen Titans that are new to the goose. Another great day to be alive. Check out the latest Titanic adventures tomorrow night at 6.30. Only on Maguzi. <laughs> Swallow 